Hi, this is a demonstration of the traffic signal management and control project. So this is an uh, advanced uh, traffic management system designed for uh, designed to control four-way traffic. So as you can see here, we have a four-way connected here with uh, signals at each end. Uh, the system is designed to smartly control the traffic by you know monitoring the traffic at uh, every road and then letting the traffic go uh, for a particular amount of time so that uh, it reaches a uh, minimum value and you know traffic from uh, all four ends continues to flow in a you know sequential manner So now we have set the values. Okay, these values indicate that uh, there are 120 cars on this road, 90 cars on this road, 100 on this one, and uh, 80 on the road below. So since now there are 100 cars on this road, this is the maximum value. So it will open this signal for 10 seconds, so that uh, you know the cars on this road matches the you know equals the minimum uh, car count on a, on the on the all of the four roads the minimum uh, since the minimum car count was 80 it will open this second this signal for exactly 10 seconds so that it reaches 80 uh, suppose if uh, there is there are uh, 150 cars here so let's set 150 so in order to you know let 150 cars go so that they reach you know the minimum count that is the 80 count the signal will be open for a, a quite longer duration of time that is 35 seconds so since we are uh, demonstrating the project here uh, we are using a small time delays in real time when it is used it will be uh, you know in minutes instead of seconds for demonstration uh, we are uh, using it in seconds uh, since the you know user can't wait for uh, that many uh, that much amount of minutes for every signal to pass in this demonstration so now when uh, you know all uh, all these signals all these the traffic at all the roads is equal what it does is it uh, switches it lets uh, five vehicles go on uh, every side that is uh, it lets you know the signal every signal for two seconds since there is no maximum uh, number at uh, number of vehicles in, uh, on any of the roads so it will uh, uh, try to decrement uh, you know each road by five at a time and let uh, each road uh, and give a green signal to each road one by one so one more uh, interesting feature here is suppose there is an ambulance at any of the roads ambulance or any police vehicle or any emergency vehicle here uh, suppose the emergency vehicle is on this road so let's click uh, emergency button here so what it will do is it will ignore the current procedure and it will let that particular uh, road go for some amount of time because it is an emergency so it will open that road for a particular amount of time so now let's uh, check this demonstration once again we set this to 150 so now it will scan for the maximum number uh, the, on, on any road so it found this one the road below and will be opening it for 40 seconds to match the lowest one that is 70 so the signal was open for 40 seconds to let the vehicles go for that particular amount of time so it becomes equal to the lowest value on any roads so this is how you know efficient uh, traffic flow is uh, managed in this system using a smart uh, traffic control algorithm thank you